Hey friends, welcome back to our channel. Today, I am super excited to share an incredible opportunity exclusively for women. That is, the Infosys Springboard Pragati program. This program is specially designed to support women in enhancing their personal development, career readiness and leadership capabilities. Whether you are looking to build your confidence, improve your professional skills or restart your career, this program can help you grow in the right direction. Stay with me till the end as I walk you through all the details and share valuable tips to complete the application successfully. I am sure that many of your doubts will be cleared after this video. So let's begin our video. The Pragati Path to Future program runs for 12 weeks that is 3 months with more sessions conducted online and the last week of the session concludes with an offline session held at one of the Infosys campuses. And the best part is it is completely free. Now who can apply? This opportunity is open to women aged 18 and above including students, job seekers, working professionals or those planning a career comeback. However men are not eligible. If they apply, their registration will be automatically cancelled. Also, if you have participated in any of the previous cohorts, you are not eligible for this cohort 7. To be eligible, you need to complete two normal courses and one certification course on Infosys Springboard. You can see here, they have mentioned that the list of the required courses and certification will be shared with you in a separate email post registration. The normal courses are very easy. You don't need to turn on your camera and you can attempt them as many times as needed. But for the certification course, you will need to turn on your camera during the exam and you get only one attempt. If you don't pass, you must wait 14 days before trying again. So make sure you are completely set right before starting the exam. If you are confused about how to complete these courses, I have already created a detailed tutorial to guide you step by step. The video link is in the description. You can watch it later. Now coming to another important task. If you are currently enrolled in college, submission of an NOC, no objection certificate from your institute is mandatory to participate. If you get your NOC, then you should submit your NOC to Springboard Support in Force Mail. If you don't know the process of how to get the NOC from your college, let me tell you. First, you need to write a letter that includes that you are going to apply for the Infosys Pragati program and so you need your management permission and approval to attend the last week offline session at Infosys office. After writing this letter, you need to get the signature of your respective coordinator or class teacher. Then, if you submit that letter to the respective office cell, they will provide the NOC document. I will just show you for the reference. You can see here. If you are not a college student, then you don't need to worry about this NOC. Now, let's talk about the registration process. Click on the registration link I have given in the description. If you already have an Infosys Springboard account, just log in. Otherwise, register for a new one. After logging in, you can see this page. If you want to begin the application, click on click to register button. Click on accept and start. After that, you can see here the cohort 7 registration form is open and now you need to fill all the details and click on the submit button which is at last. Now let me explain you step by step. At first, you need to enter your full name and the Infosys Springboard email ID. You need to remember one point here. You need to enter the same email address which you registered while registering through Infosys Springboard account. If you forget any one of those, no need to worry, I will tell you. On the top right side of the screen, you can see the profile icon. Once you click on that, you will get the all the account details. So you can see your email address, your phone number and everything you need. 
with those details you need to fill your full name and email id now going to next select the appropriate gender and they are asking whether you are 18 years or above if yes click on yes and next one is would you like to nominate yourself for infosys springboard pragati program absolutely yes right so click on yes and here you need to give a brief introduction about yourself in just less than 300 words so keep it short keep your academic background key internships and projects and you need to include what you hope to gain from Pragati program. Going to next, you need to select your education qualification. Here they have provided four options, undergraduate, graduate, postgraduate or PhD. So you need to select the appropriate option. Next one is, what is your current employment status? If you are pursuing any degree, then you can click on student option. If you have completed your graduation and looking for a job, then you need to click on looking for a job. So you need to select the appropriate option. The next one is, if you are a student, kindly provide the full name of your college. Here you need to enter your full name of your college. Here you need to enter the current city you are residing in. Here you need to enter the current state you are living in. And next one is they are asking if you are a student tell us if your institute or university is either government or private. So you need to select the appropriate option. And the next question is about NOC. I have already told you that you need to submit the no objection certificate to the Infosys Springboard email. The email is given here. You can see here. And you need to submit the NOC to the regarding email by July 18th, 2025. So you need to select whether you are a student or not a student. So I am going to select I am a student and I will submit the NOC by July 18th, 2025. Going to next, they are asking how did you know about the Pragati Path to Future program. You can select the option which is suitable to you and that's it. After filling all the details, you can click on submit button. After submitting the form, you will not receive any confirmation email, so don't panic. Infosys will contact you later with the next steps. Information about the deadline for completing the courses will be shared via email, so keep checking your inbox. This is a golden opportunity to shape your future. Don't miss it. Apply as soon as possible using the link given in the description. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments or reach out to Infosys support. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more informative updates like this. Wishing you all the best. See you in the next video. Good luck.